Turkish um, disappointing performance today. We got out of jail, didn't we? Yeah, it kind of feels like a loss. Do you know what I mean? I feel like Wolves deserved the win today. I feel like they played better than us. They had more fight than us, heart. Um, they were better on the counter than us. They, their movement was better. All round, it's probably our most disappointing performance since the beginning of the season. Mm. Um, maybe Why was it so bad? Because last week, you know, up against a you know, better team, we won the midfield battle. We were we were there to every second ball. We were, but today we we just were second to absolutely everything in that game, weren't we? Do you know what it is? The build up can can galvanise the players as well. Like building up to Liverpool, it was kind of like we're the underdogs. Can we prove ourselves? They're all fighting for Emery. We got a good result there. Well, against Liverpool mm. here, and our performance was great. But now moving on to Wolves, it's probably like we are the favourites for the match. Um, we we go back home to. Get, mm. get our wing back and it's we, we've just underperformed today I mm. feel like when we play the bigger teams we're, we're more up for the fight but Wolves are not that's not good enough though is it because you know you, not, in this not every week is you're playing the bigger teams you know I mean you've got to put in the same performances like what we did against Liverpool yeah. against these sort of teams and, and not to to be fair to Wolves they were a very very good team as well yeah Wolves are like mid, a mid-table club like mm. they're a very good club I know they've been on a bit of a bad bad form I mm. think two three losses they've come back to draw today but we can't take any of these teams for granted. Our, our quality level at Arsenal, like DT just said regarding Man City, their quality is much greater than ours. Mm. So we have to understand as fans, our quality is at a certain level and our first half performances have become customary now. Mm. So maybe that's something that needs to be addressed in January, maybe it's something that needs to be addressed in the summer, but it doesn't seem like something that can be addressed with this personnel. In, mm. in the first half, I feel like Kolasinac was out of position all for a lot, but he wasn't helped by Oba. Um, Xhaka was poor in the first half. It was his fault for the goal. Mm. It, was, it was just a, a lapse in concentration by him, and he just let the ball roll across mm. in the middle of the park and won one nil down. Um, I'm glad Emery made a half-time sub. Awobi was giving the ball away a few times, so I'm happy he made the sub. I would have probably bought Gwendozi on for Xhaka. Um, it didn't work how it's worked in previous games when we come back and get the win. But like I said, look, Wolves have drawn to Man City. They nearly came back against Tottenham from 3 0 down. Jerry so they are, United. yeah, they are a very good side and very yeah. good manager out there who, like Emery, doesn't sit down for a minute of that game. He's always instructing oh, yeah. his passion and emotions on the side. So, mm. yes, it's disappointing. Yes, it feels like a loss, but we're 16 matches unbeaten now, international yeah. break. Time to regroup, refocus. Um, a few of our players weren't selected again, which, in my opinion, is great. I don't know why there's all this hoo ha about Holden not being selected. You tell me, in the past 20 years, how many English players have gone to the England national team and come back with any credit, come back with more confidence? Maybe just Harry Kane in the past 20 years. So why do we care if Holden's not picked for, for England? It, do, it doesn't benefit us. So let's, let's keep him for the next two weeks. Let's work on this defence. I feel like Socrates needs to come back in because Mustafi was a bit suspect again out there, especially the first half. Um, that's an issue. But look, let's not, let's not be too downbeat about 60 matches unbeaten. Let's move forward now. We've got a very difficult December. We're going Brighton, Southampton, United, Liverpool. We're all over the place in December. So that Bournemouth away next game is very important. So let's get the win.